Welcome back to the Real Estate Rat Pack Radio Show with Chris, Joe, and Rob. The crew is taking your calls, so dial in at 1 800 808 5548. And hashtag we're back. (laughs) She almost caught us again. (laughs) Yes. Hashtag we're back, by the way. Hashtag we're back. I understand we had a caller hanging out. You know, we do have a caller right now, actually. We have a caller that is calling in. He uh, or she actually is with. Larry's company. She looking for a raise? Deborah, how you doing? Uh, exactly. She's exactly. with his company for the moment. <laughs> she was, she was Hashtag not random. <laughs> <laughs> this is a specific person. <laughs> oh. Deborah, how you doing? I'm doing great. This is the first time that I had the opportunity of listening to your radio station. Oh, and you still tuned in. And you, and, you're st- and you hung on the line. Man. <laughs> and you're still here. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's very brave of you. <laughs> well, I just want to commend uh, Larry because I've been with him now about six months, but I've been in the real estate business quite some time. And I really appreciate he and Mr. Davis for sharing uh, their experience, their technology with Old agents as well as new agents. We, we don't call them old agents. We call them seasoned agents. <laughs> seasoned. And that's in honor of me, by the way. <laughs> Seriously seasoned. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag I am seasoned. Yeah, we, just, we just lost our producer. <laughs> we made her snort. <laughs> Thank so, you so much, Deborah, again, for those wonderful words. I wanted to call in to let Larry know that I am listening to the radio station, and I appreciate the knowledge that he has. So is it as funny out there as it is in here? <laughs> yeah. Just, no, not so much. <laughs> I'm here to get show some houses now. Good. And Fantastic. the lady that called in and wanted to know about Pearland, I'll be happy to take her. <laughs> there we go. There you go. Well, how, does, how would anyone get a hold of you? If you have a phone uh, number you'd like to be contacted? Na- well, I work with Brooks and Davis. And my number is 832-410-0081. So call her if you're listening. Give her a call. There you go. The other caller. The other caller. (laughs) Thanks for calling, Joe. Thanks, Deborah. Thank you very much, Deborah. All right. You're welcome. Bye-bye. If if you do have questions for our, our real estate rock stars that are in the studio today, you can give us a call in the studio at 800-808-5548. And let's talk with Hillary. You received this great honor that the twenty under four. We hadn't even talked about that yet, and, and that was what precipitated us inviting him. I'm, I'm just uh, delighted to well, have with him all on. The hashtag randomness going it's on. Yeah, the <laughs> hashtag randomness going on. It's not raining talk, in here. T- talk about the honor and what it took to to receive this honor. You know, I'm I'm really so touched by HAR and their support to us as agents. I, I can't even tell you. It's really truly an honor to be recognized with all the great agents we have in, here in Houston. You know, 26,000 agents in Houston. Well, there's not that so, many of them wow. under 40 anymore. No, okay, okay. Yeah, and <laughs> They're all seasoned. We're all seasoned. <laughs> yeah, and I actually did not receive it the first time I applied two yeah. years ago. So I was encouraged by HAR yeah. and Roz and some great people over there to reapply, and I did, and I was, I was just touched. Don't we have an incredible staff at HAR? Incredible. Oh, the incredible. support, Rita, Bob Hale. I mean, it just doesn't get any better it than just, that, too. And, 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 and you can speak a lot to that because – you obviously coming from the New York City real estate market, right? Then moving to the Houston real estate market, there's a big difference. I mean, and I'm not just talking about the type of real estate you sell, but also the support you have within there. Oh, New York is just—it's just, <laughs> <laughs> it, just for free for all. Isn't it? Yes, it's like the wild, wild and west. Very political. Yes, very political. Yes, in there. it's all who you know. Um, which that's not unlike a lot of other industries or businesses or locations. However, um, we're really in Houston. We're just a team. I mean, it doesn't matter if you work at my firm or if you work for another broker. It doesn't matter. We're gonna. The chances of us working together again as an agent is more likely than us working with that client again. That's a true professional right. because we we call it coopetition. I mean, they might be your competitor, but you know what? The, the competitor that you lost the listing to, you might have the buyer for that house next week. That's and right. And so you know. Uh, all the true professionals play nicely in the sandbox. Right. Now, there's some out there who don't play nicely in the sandbox, but they kind of have a tendency to... to uh, Slip away. Uh, uh, yeah, by attrition and uh, leave the industry. So uh, anyway, so what's the criteria to, to, to receive this honor? You know, it's based on a number of factors, and it, it's really about community involvement, 
It, there is some production numbers involved, um, the level of, of real estate that you sell, but it's really about what your goals are, how you're going to help your community, what your volunteers opportunities are and w- what you do. So what's your passion in the community? You know, my passion is really working with kids and volunteering at the schools. So not only um, am I 20 under 40, but I just finished the Texas Realtor Leadership Program. And our, our volunteer opportunity was uh, raising money for Yellowstone Academy. And these kids are fabulous. Yeah. And they deserve every opportunity they, that they we can They've managed to get a few hundred of my dollars already. Yes. You guys are really good at selling that. Yes. It, but it's a great – it is great. Talk a little bit about Yellowstone. Yellowstone is a private school – located um, east of downtown, and it's just a wonderful environment. They provide uniforms and food and snacks, breakfast, snack, lunch, snack afternoon. Um, They bus these kids to and from school. Most of the parents of these children are single single parents and earn less than $10,000 a year. Oh, wow. That's that's uh, that's hard to imagine something like that. So, um, how do they qualify to get it? I mean, is there a waiting list to, to get into the programs? There stuff? is, and the school's not been around that long um, since the early two thousands inception. But they have to apply, they have to qualify. Um, there is qualifications, and and really, it's it's needs based. So, a well, lot of these kids. I'm going to give you a chance to brag yeah. about how much uh, the TRLP class raised. Uh, there was a big check on stage, yeah. and it had lots of numbers on How much was that? We raised over $43,000 for Yellowstone Academy. And that was in how wow. long of a time, period of time? Very short period of time, five weeks. I said wow. they were good at fundraising. They got money out of me. You yeah. Know, you know, I'm tight. Yeah. yeah. No, I, we, were there, we were at that, that event, uh, you know, last week. It was a great event, and it goes to a great – you know, one of the things we talk about is – and we see this in, in, in all of our community. We do it as a – as a radio show, we do it as individuals. But, you know, find something you're passionate for. Find something that you can get involved with and give back. You know, giving back, I'll tell you, is so rewarding when you see people's faces, children's faces, especially. You know, we as a Rat Pack also every year do our sponsorship for, for this time of year for uh, the Depelchins Children's Center, for example. And, and let me tell you, it just makes such a big difference. The more you give, you know, the, the greater you get back. And I'm not even talking about financially. or I'm talking about what you get as far as the emotion right. on, 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 on doing something like that. So It's exponential to the dollars. Right. So yeah, absolutely. I, it fills your soul. And, yes. and, you know, we work hard and people always say, you guys make so much money. But, you know, at the end of the day, it's not about the money. It's about what you're doing for other people yeah. and helping them, whether it find a house or raise money for a yeah. school. And every time I hear something negative about realtors, and you know, sometimes we get included with, with, with bad salespeople and things like that. But I've never seen a community in such a large part give back to their community, and and we we are usually in touch with people. Somebody's calling us. <laughs> Wrong number. <laughs> um, and so you know, you know, kudos to to the realtor stuff. And some, um, Larry, I'm going to ask you the same question. I mean, you had a passion, and you and and you've qualified for this uh, award as well. Um, Tell me what your passion is, and I know you're giving back to the community. I do quite often. I um I am I'm, I'm I'm passionate about the kids as well. I am a Houstonian. I grew up in the inner city here, and uh, just to, just not only personal circumstances, but just the circumstances that I see when I go and visit old friends or or even family members. Just the, the idea of being able to give back the time and the energy. Um, the Yellowstone School is is a great school. I've had an opportunity to participate in several of their fundraising activities. And it is most definitely one of those things right now that is that is a need base for those kids. And and if you can, you should most definitely take part in it. Um, I also reach out and help when it comes to home builder programs, you know. And when I say home builder, I mean like the Urban League offers uh, challenges for you to go out and help people build their homes, fix their neighborhoods. Um, when I was on the NRG advisory group, we did that where we would go out and, and find an elderly person or a challenged person and, and, and you know, re, remodel I've actually been on a lot of those builds. Yeah, uh, so, yeah, I show up with my ladder and yeah, my so, blue jeans. and Yeah, so those are key, those are things that I really love giving back because I know that in a lot of cases there's things that they cannot do themselves. So for us to go out and give our energy and some of our finances to it is most definitely a plus. You know, we're almost coming to the lightning round time. We are coming around to the lightning round. We have three minutes to go for an excellent show is put in the books. But with that being said, our lightning round really is we want you we want you to say statistical you know, math problem. That is yeah. correct. We want you to, to, to what you want people to walk away from the show today and then of course we want to know how to get a hold of you. Yeah, as well. that is correct. And a statistical math problem would also be pretty good. Yeah. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> just a random just a random problem. You know? of... <laughs> 
<laughs> Hillary, we'll start okay. off with you. Yeah, what do you want everybody to leave the show with? I think I really want people to leave the show with knowing that you can contact a professional. You can increase your property's value using their knowledge, using their experience, rather than trying to do it yourself. You know, I mean, you are opening yourself up to a lot of legal things that you don't even fully understand as a seller or a buyer without using an agent. So contact your local professional. Call me. Call Larry. We'll help you out, and uh, we'll get you the right property. Well, if I How can we to call reach you? you? Yes, you can reach me at 713-933-4141, and that would also be H Chung, C-H-U-N-G, at MarthaTurner.com. H-Chung or you can do hashtag random Turner. people. Okay. Yes, she comes up. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and Larry, how about you? What would you like to have everybody leave the show with? Well, I, I, I want everyone to know that the thing about real estate is more about the history and the time and the work, a body of work that you've put into it. So myself, I'm the broker owner of a small boutique real estate firm, but we give you the services of a large international firm. So I want you to keep that in mind when you're looking at realtors and the expert, the expert, the experience that they've had in, in the industry. Industry. Um, I can be reached at uh, I'm on Instagram and every other social media. So it's uh, at Texas Real Estate King. Uh, you can also find us on Facebook, Brooks and Brooks and Davis. Uh, in addition to that, my our contact number is seven one three six. Oh, I'm sorry, seven one three six six five eight three two nine. We're we're excited about the business. Our website is brooksanddavis.com or Larry W. Brooks and. Uh, and Thank he will be registering the new hashtag, hashtag random that, people. Well, also, I'm thinking hashtag 15 <laughs> minutes to downtown should be the other one. <laughs> I'm, I'm just a lot of hashtags right there tied into me. All the hashtags to Larry right there. You know, we tell everybody, we always like to leave the show with a saying. And, you know, one of the things, one of the things we're going to leave it off today is the golden rule. You know what that golden rule is, Rob? He who has the gold makes the rules. <laughs> <laughs> Not that one, huh? Do unto others as you would want them to do unto you. You know, time flies when you're having fun. Look us up on Facebook at on Facebook.com or on our website, realestateratpack.com. Until next time, we are out. And you've been listening to the Real Estate Rat Pack. The question is, who's Frank, who's Sammy, who's Dean, and who's the other guy? Uh, Chris, is, yes, Chris Frank. is Frank, I'm he's Dean. Dean, and I'm Sammy. Yes, yeah. he's Dean. <laughs> <laughs> right. yeah. So tune in to the really big show every Saturday at 9 a.m. right here on 100.7 The Word, KKHT.